Sustainable development is the only pathway we want for all. Top of the morning to you viewers, you are watching Gaza Media, the best grassroots media of our time. Nje Lebang, Fonge Monina Wan in quotes, is one of those villages that served as an oasis for internally displaced persons during the socio-political crisis which greatly affected Lebialem and Debang in particular. This crisis did not just displace families but also brought down buildings and houses. And there have been discussions about technical education to train the youth on the skills to solve emergency infrastructure problems facing the bank and its neighboring villages. Thus, in Koda USA's convention is focused on raising money to support the functioning of the aforementioned training college. Now, back to other nitty gritties concerning this gathering. It will take place on the 5th and 6th of July 2024 in West Bowie Village Hall, Maryland. <laughs> Nje village, located in the Banfondo, is one of the surviving villages that was not over affected by the crisis due to its geographical location. And most IDP migrated to this village for shelter and greener pasture, if you will. For this reason, Nje Cultural and Development Association, Kuda USA, embarked in solar electricity and water project to serve the local. <laughs> Year, and according to the convention organizing chair, Mr. Evis Atem, development will focus on transformative education, which he described as practical education. You can tell from the uh, from the theme of our convention that uh, we have come to realize that uh, practical education is a key. It's what uh, holds uh, development. Um, so uh, we believe it has come time where we give a little bit of attention, not just a little bit, we give quite an attention uh, to building a foundation for our kids in jail. Of course, in today's era, it is driven by technology and practical skill. And Mr. Evi said, it is the vision of the youth from JA to transform the existing technical school to become the art of science with simulating lab to start training students at the early age. Um, we are lucky to have had already uh, a structure that harbors a technical education in, in JA. Uh, so this convention is geared to raise funds uh, to see that we begin to build uh, an IT foundation for our kids. Uh, we build um, electrical foundation for our kids. We build plumbing uh, foundation for our kids. We build um, carpentry foundation for our kids. Uh, in such a way that in the next five to ten years, as a long-term goal, we'll be able to be having, we'll be able to have graduates from um, from JA who can proudly go out to the job market and be able to make some money for themselves and, of course, support the community. Yes, especially in this post-crisis where many structures have been uh, we are asking people to go back home. If you look at some of the images, they are no longer compounds. And we therefore mean that we need some manpower, or we need our own children to build those houses. That is very correct. Uh, that is a very good point. And uh, by this, uh, let me just give a hand of applause to uh, the present administration for bringing in the solar panels. And of course, like you said, it uh, is going to need maintenance. And that is what we are trying to draw from to make sure that we have kids that will be trained uh, to be able to handle the solar panels that have already been installed in NJ. And again, like you quoted the crisis, uh, our villages have faced a lot of crises, and uh, it is high time that uh, we begin to recycle and see that we can bring back our kids uh, for uh, the rebuilding of the community. And that is why we want to um, use this as an avenue uh, to start, um, you know, training these kids, make them understand 
the need for them to have hands-on practical education so hands-on practical education that can be used for the reconstruction of whatever has been destroyed or for the reconstruction of whatever we have to rebuild in jail. More of this discussion and presentation will be yours on Saturday, July 6, in Bowie Village Hall in Maryland, followed by fundraising gala night. And Gaza Media Reporter will be standby to bring you minute by minute update. Just like their objective, the theme for this year's convention is empowering minds, unleashing the potentials of practical education in Inje. VIP tickets are readily available from silver to gold and to premium. You can always do your reservations through the contacts on your screens. Lastly, after a long discussion, members will be entertained by Sami Diko and DJ Active. So, you wouldn't want to miss out. Karen Njualen for presentation.